Roughnecks. You know, we've we've seen a lot of stupid cover, you know, with the morons that we've covered on this channel. I don't know that I've ever seen a supposed channel owner so inept that he can't even play a video while live streaming. Sad, sad. But you know what? Let's have a look at it. It's kind of funny. Enjoy. It's going to blow your mind. We're going to do a video too, but who's the more, who said that? Who, who were you talking to? Who's Sue? Uh, you're a moron. Who's Sue? Does anybody know who Sue is? Cause I'll gladly block her. Oh, that's right. Cause you can't take any criticism or him. Probably a boy named Sue. I don't know. Anyway, that was really rude. Sue, be careful. Uh, Did you just threaten? Sue, is that like a physical threat? Because we know you're not above assaulting a woman. What would you guys say if I told you? Um, it's going to sound the same, but it's not. Put a one in chat if you guys are familiar with me saying that the government has been manipulating records to cause me damages. Bullshit! Bullshit! You asked. Two in chat if you don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Uh, two, you don't know what in the hell you're talking about. What I have been alleging that I've been experiencing is a manipulation of records. Uh, do we all understand what records is? And, and first of all, is my picture coming in clear? This computer seems like it's working awesome. Um, so manipulation of records being entered into my court hearings. That's what I've been saying. Thank uh, and I'm not going to be able to take my attention away a lot because I'm on a brand new laptop. I've never used a single monitor before um, to do screen share. So, And you've been live streaming for how many years now? Um, okay. Uh, yeah, manipulation of records. Holy crap. What we found out. So I was in court yesterday. Uh, most of you know that. And we got a video coming. Um, I told you about uh, Scarborough lying through his teeth for a better portion of the entire amount of questioning he was doing. Um, I did not tell you about a document that was read. Uh, we all were taken back by the reading of this document. Well, I know that reading the English language confuses you, sure. At first it was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're listening to the document being read that's been entered into court in which was a probable cause hearing. So in other words, it's the cause, the document, what's on this document is the cause of why I was arrested, put in jail for 10 days, being charged with felonies, this document is the cause. And the document was being read by Scarborough on the stand. The video's coming. And at first he's reading it and everything's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. And then he gets to the very end and we're like, what the fuck did you say? That, that shouldn't be on the thing you just read. Are you English or retarded? <laughs> Oh, I agree 100% that, that you shouldn't have sent that letter. Absolutely, I do. But here's the thing. Here's the funny thing. You sent me one too, you moron. And you both, you and Tiffaho, misspelled the same words. Yes, Birdie. Birdie got it. Good job, Birdie. The cease and desist letter. Um, Put a one in chat. If you saw the video before J.J. Scarborough had it removed from my YouTube channel, if you saw the video where we served the cease and desist. I want to see how many of you see. Please put a two in the chat if you did not see that video. Now, the video he's referring to, folks, is a video where him and Tiffany committed a crime. Actually, JJ could have charged them with another one. It's called criminal trespass. See, at this point, Tiffaho, Chrysalis here, have both been formally trespassed from the Meade County Jail. They're not allowed to go up there and fraud it and hang out. He says the word serve. No, you didn't. See, a cease and desist letter is not a legal document in any way. 
he has no legal right to actually serve it. Um, so what he did was record himself committing more crimes. That's what he did. Jeff's going to grab the, I'm just going to read it real quick first. Um, shit. I'm y'all ready to try to share the screen. Let's see if I can do it. If I lose you, I'll be back. <laughs> I'm going to try to figure out how to do this. Perhaps you should have thought about that before you went live. You fucking moron. Because I have, I have a picture of it. I have a picture here. Share screen. Here, let me open it on my phone to make sure I'm doing it right. Spoiler alert, kids. This is going to be very, very painful to watch. I mean, painful. And for the record, no, he doesn't get it. But it should be nothing new for him. Chris, you look more lost than a bastard on Father's Day. This is sad. Yeah, I think I'm doing it right. Is that what your ex has told you? I should have made it smaller. Let me let me try to make the picture bigger. Oh, that got weird. All right, I'm not real sure. And this is the computer skills that you use to run a successful business? Interesting. Sorry, y'all. I'm trying to figure this out. I'll get it in a minute. I know we're looking at me, looking at me, looking at me, looking at you, looking at you, looking at you. Uh <laughs> Bear in mind, folks, that while he's out on 11 different bails, he is to remain drug and alcohol free. I don't believe that he is. But I think if I pull. All right. This is just too damn painful. We're going to skip ahead, folks. Seven and a half minutes later. Well, I think it's working. Okay. We got it. All, All right. right. From the raw, unedited footage. Okay, guys? This is the raw, unedited footage straight out of my memory card of the day that I went and served, me and Tiffany went and served uh, the cease and desist to JJ. And I want you to listen and watch very carefully. I don't think so. <laughs> And again, a cease and desist letter is not a legal document. What you did was break the law. You are aware of that because you are trespassed formally from that jail. The only way you're allowed at that jail, Chrissy, is if you are in handcuffs. Listen to every word. And look at the letter. Now, look, my home address is on this thing. I, I can't be more uh, transparent than this. I don't want anybody abusing this, but, you know, fuck it. Everybody else has been putting my home address out. So here you go. Uh, watch, guys. Watch this. So here's here's what it says. Um, which our uh, address is on there. I'll have to redact that. But uh, actually, I'm not going to show the paper like this because I'll take a picture of it and do the redacting. But uh, it says, Dear Mr. J.J. Scarborough, which is uh, John Justin Scarborough, you are hereby notified to cease and desist in any and all further unlawful defamation, slander, and or libel, which first occurred on December 1st, 2023, when you participated in a live stream panel on the channel Fraud at Wrangler, Fraud at Wrangler, which is actually uh, Michael Kaiser's channel, on panel with the channel owner, Michael Kaiser, you are hereby requested to immediately cease and desist any illegal defamation, slander, and or libel. Within 10 business days, refrain from any further acts of said defamation, slander, or libel with regards to Mr. Ryder or Miss Napier's character or reputation. Failure to comply with this cease and desist will leave Mr. Ryder and Miss Napier no further alternative 
but to pursue any and all available legal and equitable remedies available to protect their character and or reputation. Signed, yours truly mm -hmm. and dearly. I think I did pretty good on that one. I think I did pretty good on that one. Wait, 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 wait. I thought you told everybody that you copied that off the internet. So if you pulled that off the internet, how did she do a good job with it? I'm curious. And by the way, I don't believe legal documents have that many misspelled words. What's a dicist anyway? You can't, you just can't be ready for this. Like, like there is no way to be ready for this. Can y'all see that? This was presented as evidence in the courtroom yesterday. This here, take a read, take a look, take a read at the last line. Take a look at those signatures and let's read the last line. Failure to comply with this cease and desist request will leave Mr. Ryder and Ms. Napier no other alternative but to pursue other avenues to remedy the problem, which could include but not limited to criminal action and or civil action. Failure to adhere to this request could also put your daughter in harm's way and or on the news like Sheriff Wimpy's son. Well, seeing as how Sheriff Wimpy's son was tragically murdered, are you threatening his daughters? Are you threatening J.J. Scarborough's daughters? Game on, bitch. That is not the cease and desist that we brought. Dude, you're the one holding it, you moron. This is not the cease and desist letter that we brought. This one was created by some fuck nut to have me put in jail. What are you talking about, moron? This is your video. This is your video that you claim has been taken down for months because he violated your rights somehow. But this is your video. You're the one that just read it off. Again, how did he put that letter that's in your hand right now? You are playing a recording of you holding that letter, reading it off to the camera. We did not bring that. You just watched the video of what we brought. We served it to JJ. He wanted it up and threw it at me. You just watched the clip of the actual unedited footage. No, 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 no. You claimed it was unedited footage. Here's the problem. You're a lying piece of shit. You also claim that you're not a woman abuser, but I have proven beyond any doubt that you are. And again, guys, believe what you want. But he literally just played the video. That's his hand. That's him holding that letter, reading it off to y'all. So y'all believe what you want. I believe, I know, that they set, sent that threatening piece of trash letter to J.J. Scarborough. It's funny how the signatures on it match the ones that you guys emailed me, isn't it? Anyway, y'all, it's Wrangler. I'm out of here. I love y'all. Have a good one. Chris, stop being, I mean, you're not even trying anymore.